from a warm and sunny Singapore. We are in conversation today with Mr. Khagra Jadhikari, who is a member of parliament in Nepal. And I'm speaking to him at the third APCAT, that is the Asia-Pacific Cities Alliance for Tobacco Control and Prevention of Non-Communicable Diseases, meeting which is taking place here in Singapore. And we are indeed fortunate to have with us uh, Mr. Adhikari because Nepal has taken a big lead in the Asia-Pacific region on tobacco control, including having very large pictorial warnings uh, and uh, implementation of Article 5.3. We will hear more from him now. Mr. Adhikari, what motivated you to work for tobacco control and prevention of NCDs? for the people you represent. Nepal has done and got Bloomberg Philanthropic Award all over the world. Nepal done well in warning, 90%. That was first all over the world. Now, Timor Leste is leading. When I was working my ministry, health and population, in the three years back, I was uh, suffering from passive smoker because my father was sane smoker and I was affected myself. I kindly request to him to stop uh, use tobacco complaints. He was sane smoker. Before his death, two years ago, he stopped to use that tobacco complaint. So that was my commitment in from very my my beginning when. Fortunately, I got chance to lead the Ministry of Health and Population. I decided myself to increase the pictorial health warning messages in tobacco complaints. And because I, I know very well, 121,000 people yearly died by using the tobacco complaints. It is not a uh, joke. It is a very serious matter. Government always give some incentive to cancer patients, uh, heart patients, and kidney patients, stroke patients, diabetics patients. That is a, you know, that is not a sufficient incentive for patients. First of all, we should have to motivate it. Prevention is better than cure. We should not have to establish the hospital, but we have to create awareness to establish the stadium health activity. If we have to suffering from that type of problem, we must have to face that challenges. So I was motivated by the poor people where I was engaging to political activity in urban areas. They, they were always suffering from, you know, treatment, lodging and fooding, hand to mouth problem. But unfortunately, they use tobacco cigarettes, beads, and then they are, they, they are losing their, you know, very important lungs, kidney, and uh, heart, and, uh, you know, valves, etc. So, I saw their problem, because I am from very, that areas, and I am a son of peasants, farmers. So, I knew what is the problem in bottom level. That is very inspiring, Mr. Radhikari, because uh, this is actually what uh, our Mahatma Gandhi believed in, that if the work which you are doing is for the lowliest of the lower people, then you go ahead and then that is important. So could you share some uh, measures or steps which you have taken in your constituency to promote uh, tobacco control and to prevent uh, non-communicable diseases? Any specific measures you would like to share? I always honored Mahatma Gandhi and you know, because they uh, two great leaders uh, make free from colonialism, from, you know, imperialism. And now India and China, they are enjoying democratic exercise and the uh, enrichment and uh, they are scaling the poor people to better life. So those two persons are inspiring for politics and politicians. One thing is that when I was engaging in my duty and job, my constituency is very loyal to me because they gave me big victory. There is a very big gapping between me and my arrival uh, because uh, they know how tobacco control is 
effective to better life. In the school, the students, I gather and collect the school students in primary level and high school level as well as the campus level. Because I was a student activist. I won two times president in, you know, larger college in Prithvinayana campus, Pukhara. Mm -hmm. there, there are a larger number of students studies in that college. I won two times. So my relation is very close to bottom level students, as well as the teachers. I gather the teacher and I make one training, thought program, appreciative inquiry, positive approach. And all the private schools and the government school teachers were gathering there and they motivate to convince, to not use the tobacco products in their father, mother and their guardians. When we make one gathering in the school, they will go back to their house and they can convince their mother, father, cousins and family members, please don't use the tobacco complaints because you do not able to afford me buy pencil and you know stationary materials, but you are wasting the money for your bad health. So please stop it and help me. They can make a, one campaign in my constituency. I'm thinking about to promote these types of uh, campaign, make my, by, uh, you know, uh, musical tournament and, uh, you know, some types of competition, uh, talent competition. Then they can make sure to their uh, guardian to convince not using that types of tobacco complaints. And that is great actually because uh, targeting the youth or, and rather speaking with the youth and because children can get anything done from their parents if yes. they come to it. So they can get some positive uh, things done as well. How is the local leadership like mayors or other at the local level? How can they help you or are they helping you in your uh, campaign? This is a very good uh, opportunity to me now. After 20 years, local body is elected now. Uh, me, my constituency, Mir is my very, very, very good colleagues. Both we are college mates. And the local body's leaders are my cadres. So they can understand my efforts, my motto. I hope that they will join with me easily. So the campaign will be success in my constituency. That is not only limited, that will extend in my districts, province, and the, you know, province minister, chief minister, is also my colleagues. This is a very good opportunity to me. So I hope that we can do together to make sure that for youth, better future and the next generation tobacco free generation. What is your take home uh, message and lesson from this third APCAT? And why do you think that forums like this are important? I think that lesson learned from this third Asia Pacific meeting. When I heard from Indonesian mayors, but Indonesia is doing well in local level, not central level. There is some problem. Local awareness is very high than the central awareness. And Philippines also so doing as low as. And you know Singapore is centrally driven to stop tobacco use uh, and uh, you know india nepal bangladesh th these are a huge populated area densely populated area pa pakistan these areas when will not be in taken that type of uh, measures to stop tobacco use then we will we'll not get our mission so i have got uh, different types of you know experience from this meeting i hope that we can make better from lesson learned. So, anyway, we have to make a agenda in central government and provincial government. Local level is, uh, you know, implementers. All in implementers are very encouraged, very courageful and inspired. So, I hope that this area, Asia Pacific region will be tobacco free region in coming days. That's a great take home message. And just one more thing I wanted to ask. Uh, 
in your country is chewing tobacco also a problem or is it only about smoking? Yes, non-smoking tobacco complaints also. Somehow people are using tobacco complaints in another form, only not in cigarettes. So we should have to take measures to stop all types of tobacco complaints. And now government is launching another thing, anti-alcohol campaign also. Government priority is uh, to stop the alcohol. So first of all, we should have to convince the central government. Gradually, central government is capturing our ideas. I hope that com government will convince in very soon. But you know, Nepal has uh, same problem as, as India because somehow women are suffering from gold trafficking and you know, rape case. So some of you know, tobacco users and drugs and alcohol users are engaging in criminal cases. So government is very aware to stop it. I hope that another form of tobacco is also the misleading the, the country, provincial level and the local level. So we are very aware to stop it. Thank you very much. We were in conversation with Mr. Khagraj Adhikari, a member of parliament from Nepal.